welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a book review for The Travelers by Ellie Delano. This book, this book, I just finished it. I give it four stars. Very solid book. My only problem is the love interest, the romance in this seems a little tropey. But other than that, I quite enjoyed it. I finished it like in a day and a half and it just came out Tuesday and I was very excited for this one because I thought it was a time traveling book but it turns out it's not. It is a traveling through different realities which is still cool which is still cool but it just wasn't time travel like I thought it was so that happened. But that's okay because I was not disappointed. I like the book a lot and it came from Swoon Reads and if those of you who don't know what that is, SwoonReads.com is like an independent publishing company. I don't know if they're the ones who actually publish the books but it's a place where independent authors can go and upload their books, people read them, people vote on them and then they get published. So this is one that got voted for publishing and I'm glad it did because I quite enjoyed it. Other than the little quick romance, which really didn't even bother me that much to be honest. It really didn't. People are going to probably say something about that. So I was not bothered by it so you know. So I should tell you what the book is about, right? So this book is about a girl, Jessa who's in high school. She has very vivid, vivid? She has very vivid dreams and aspirations of becoming a writer. So she journals and logs all of her dreams and she tries to make them into stories. But she can't get this young man out of her mind. He's got green eyes, dark hair, and one day while she's volunteering, she sees him turns out that he's not just in her dreams, he is for real. And not only that, but she has known him for a long time, only not this Jessa, a Jessa from another reality. He has to tell her what and who she is. So she has the ability to travel within realities and alter them so that their choices will be different and so a different outcome will happen. Someone is trying to kill her, all the Jesses in all of the different realities, and she has to find a way to stop it. There are some plot twists, some things that I didn't see coming, and the end was really good, and it, it left you off on a cliffhanger for the next one, and I'm actually really excited to read the next one, because this book was, it was really good. I'm glad this one was published. If you go on to swoonreads.com. I'm not sure if you have to sign up for a membership or if there's like a membership fee or anything, but from what I do understand is you can read books. So that's a good way to get free books, which I'm always down for because books be expensive. Always trying to save a buck. And if you can get free books, get free books. Vote on them. Let them know that you really, really like this book and that other people should read it and then they'll get published. It's not just good for you, that's good for the authors. Who knows who the next Lee Bardugo is or Sarah J Mass, or Susan Denard or any of these really great authors. I mean, they had to start somewhere. So always, always, always support independent authors because you just never know what they're gonna write that might blow your mind, that might be your most favorite book of all time. So absolutely support independent authors. So that's my two cents on The Traveler. I really enjoyed it. Check it out from your library. Pick up yourself a copy. I don't think you'll be disappointed. I highly recommend this one. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to hit subscribe. It's that little button right down there. And until next time, bye guys.